today. Hello guys. I want to video today will show you how to remove the right protection of a Chromebook at full guard. Uh, firstly, you need to remove the screws of your Chromebook. I just already have that done, so I'm going to record that. Open your Chromebook. This was, you see these are already opened, but you will see how they get something open of something 10. It's not like this, I'm close. And you see the battery right over here. Disconnect it. Keep it like that. Charger. Connect it. Make sure your Chromebook's in death mode. To go death mode, you press the SC, refresh, and then turn in the shutdown button. Shut down button. All in the same time, okay? And then when someone such screen up here on the screen like screen like this, press control D. And for me, I just go browse disgust. So continue, of course. Then do this. Control, Alt, T. Then this will be a cross. Show. Hold up one second, guys. Let's check something. Okay, never mind. The Chromebook update will update it. Hmm. Show. So, yes, yeah, two cameras are not used with that, of course, we know. See when this then this command. Well, guys, I'll pause it for a second. Okay, never mind, guys. Do not use. Do not do Control Alt T. Do this instead. Control Alt. This arrow. It will pop it on this screen. For me, I do not allow a root login password, so I just click root. Obviously, I just clip root, and I'm also I'm already in root. See, door rev five, based on my root. Basically, okay, now turn it off for myself. You got to type in this command over here. Okay, I'm gonna type this command real quick. Okay, okay guys. What is hey guys, it's giving an error in a few few seconds. I mean, error for you yeah, guys when you press Control Alt and this button over here. You have to type in Chronos, not root. You type in the command, it should work. Okay, it's working. Thank you. Thanks, Lord. Thought I was going to spend another few minutes looking. It's, it's put my, burn my brain out. Yeah, you see, it's not really the files needed. Yeah, you see? Different characters. Software with right protection enabled. Just sit there for you guys. If you plan to flash your Wi-Fi, you must disable it for flashing. You can then put Y, of course. And then it will reboot. Yep. And if I remember correctly. I don't need to go into that mode. This, this, that. Ah, I was right. Prone OS. Da -da -da. I'll type the command. Boombox.tech slash frame where uh, Framework, it, it, 
that blurry or just that my vision is horrible after a bit this will pop up as you can see my computer is uh hp chromebook 14 g6 dorp intel gaming lake as you see the one is growing green these are green, that means the repetition is, is off. It's, when it's red, the repetition is on. Okay, you got two. That means 45. Yes, you'll be able to knock on us, of course. I. X. No, no, no. Type I accept in all cups. Of course, that's why. Then you'll see you know USB to make a global drive. To make not a global drive, but backup of the firmware. Yes, this is a long process, but it, it is what it is. Any eugenic storage you USB should work. As long as the USB has enough storage, it should work. That use that storage to lie. And you see, it is saving the files. Save it for a backup as stock firmware Dorp 2024 1007. Not wrong. After it's done, it's time to remove the USB stick, do it do as told, click press enter. And then it will start, start installing the, 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 the ROM framework. Now I recommend you to wait, because this will, this will take a while. After a bit, you'll see this, you have the same clear RP range, so in full this may take up to 90 seconds. Put this here.
Okay, after that, yes, it's done. Press enter. Just click R to reboot. Press enter. Okay, rebooting. Also, you'll be you'll be free to connect the battery back. But first, let me just disconnect this. Disconnect this the power first. We want to call the short circuit now, shall we? Oh, you always know. I don't think that. Uh, Basically any operating system you want. Okay, not almost, not almost every. The ones that are not compatible are Mac OS. That if you want to use Open Core EFI, that that will not work comparably. Since the if these Chromebooks are called coordinated Gemi Lake, if you want that to work, you have to make a custom a custom. EFI. And what you read right or not, it's the end of the video. I must like tell you guys, it was a good and good day making this video. Just hit the it'll be nice if you like, subscribe, hit hit that notification bell to always receive new videos. And whether you like it or not, bye bye.